guys and welcome back! If you're new on my channel, then hello! My name is Jana and I post videos five times a week, so you can be sure that on this channel you'll always get something interesting to watch. That's why make sure to subscribe and ring the bell so you will be the first one who is going to be updated about my newest videos. So that's been said, you can see how excited I am because I will review a designer novelty that I am in love with and that is Pure Musk by Narciso Rodriguez for her. I hope I pronounce his name correctly. I'm sorry if I don't, but this perfume is what I'm living for right now. Honestly, guys, when I saw it in the store, I was like, oh my god, you need to be good. You better be good. <laughs> so it looks so so nice. I just really enjoy this matte design, this white color. It is pretty unique and uh, it feels so good. So I closed my eyes in the store. I sprayed it all over myself and I was gone. Guys, this is such a great scent of pure and uh, fresh flowers. So it opens with this uh, almost green floral scent that is pretty clean and uh, the flowers are almost wet in there. I'm telling you there is a dewy floral feeling that is pretty recognizable and it reminds me of um, some flowers with waxy and um, almost satin-like feeling. For example, magnolias and some orchids can have that texture. So when I smell it right away in the opening, it is pretty fresh and clean and very floral and it is like a powdery floral scent. Also because of that musk, you know, musk sits right on top of that floral dewiness and it is not too dominant first because flowers are pretty intense and um, this perfume really lets your imagination play because you can imagine magnolias or you can imagine some other white floral flowers that are pretty fresh. That's where I find it is amazing perfume for spring because it almost has like a green floral scent first, but that all depends on your imagination because it is a pretty simple scent. It is not too complex, but the simplicity is its success. So after a few minutes, maybe like half an hour, musk becomes more dominant and that is amazing classy white floral musk that is so elegant in the combination with white flowers and I find that that scent is so new nowadays. Actually it does remind me of some retro fragrances. It has uh, not really an old-fashioned vibe, that's for I really enjoyed, that it is still modern and up-to-date, but still it reminds me of something from my childhood that ladies used to wear back then. So it is still pretty modern and I really enjoy that this novelty really stands out from all the other releases when fragrances try to be all at once, gourmand and sweet and floral and fruity and oriental and that all is in one perfume. In here it is not the case. It is about white floral muskiness and it is done correctly. It is so elegant and it is pretty fresh so it is amazing for summer and spring but it is also really wearable in the winter time and it is especially great to wear to work because it is actually a little bit formal but still has a bit of a romance going on in there. So it is an interesting perfume for sure and you can pair it with a nice white uh, 
shirt like I did and check it out it has lace open back so this is almost like this perfume it is simple when you look at it first but then you actually recognize and notice some sensuality and sexiness about it that is hidden so I really love it a lot even though it does not project Intensely, it gives you more of a, a musky, powdery, fresh sillage, which is pretty nice. And uh, I highly recommend to try it because I'm obsessed. I find that this is the best designer release of the year so far. And I'm looking forward to hear from you guys. What is your feedback? Have you already tried it out? What do you think? If not, definitely give it a try. And comment below what is your favorite white floral musky scent. I'm looking forward to hear from you guys. Let's chat. And that completes this video. I hope that you enjoyed watching it. And if you learned something new, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And that's all. We'll see each other in the next one really soon. Bye, guys.